Okay, good morning. It's, uh, what is today? What is today? Today's Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday, August 31st. It's uh, mom's birthday. Happy birthday, mom. And uh, I'm here at the uh, Carson City Sheriff's Office in the uh, Carson City Courthouse. Just went into the courthouse, finished uh, that. Uh, check it in with the uh, people I need to check in for the bail that they gave me the other day. And uh, I'm going to head over to the sheriff's office next and uh, go record all that. And do a public information request on all the officers that were there, all their information, all that good stuff. And I'm going to ask to speak to the sheriff and see if he's willing to sit down and talk to me. So that's the plan for this morning, to do another First Amendment audit. Uh, take our camera out in the public, uh, keep the public employees accountable to all of us that are hopefully watching, and uh, y'all get to make your decisions on what you think is right and what you think is wrong with, with the world that we live in and the laws and the government that affect us all. Here we go. And let's see, no signs on their doors. If you need assistance. Good morning, how are you? Good. Uh, yeah, I have uh, an information request form to um, turn in there. Okay, as far as the, um, as far as the reports, those are kept in civil. Okay. In the corner there, then the door open. So okay. You can check there for reports. But as far as the rest of it, I'll have to have a sergeant come and see if he can get this information for you. Oh, okay. good. Let but me see if he's available. Go ahead and hold on to that, hon. And if you'll have a seat over there, I'll go back and see if he's available. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. And what's your, what's your name? My name is Shirley. Oh, Shirley, thank you very much. You're I'm right here. Go. I'm just okay. wandering Sergeant around. Riggins is the one you'll need to speak okay. with, and he's not here right now. Okay. He's out in a meeting. So I'm going to give you his number, and you can call him and set up an appointment to come in and see him. Okay. Is uh, Ken but Furlong available to talk for a minute? They're in staff meetings on Wednesday mornings. Okay. So what, what time do those generally end? About 1030. Okay. okay. I'll give you his card and Sergeant Riggins, but as far as the... Good morning. Good morning. I'll be with you in a moment, sir. As far as the reports go, you're happy to go into and welcome to go into civil and okay. get a copy of that. Okay, cool. Okay. Let me give you those cards and if you want to go into civil, I'll get them ready for you. Okay, I appreciate it. Okay, I'll be right back then with some cards. I'll, I'll be right back. Are you going to give me the cards now or? Okay, thank you. Sir, here you go. So there's um, the sheriff's card. Does it have his email in there? Um, it does. It's right here. Oh, perfect. Okay. And then it has his direct line and his extension for his general line, but that's the other one is his direct number. Okay. And then this is the sergeant that you would need to refer to because he's our watch commander. Okay. It's Darren Reagan, and that's his direct number. Okay. And uh, who would I file an internal affairs complaint with? You would check with Sergeant Riggins when you called him, or you can ask Sheriff Furlong also, sir. Okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. Me. Hello, they sent me over here to see you. They said you were the person to get part of this public information request done. Let's see your driver's license. Why is a driver's license required for an information request? I'm going to give it to her. Yeah, I don't want to provide ID for that. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Next person in line. Hello, Mr. Rybar. Rebar. Rebar. Nice to meet you. I'm Darren. Hey, Darren. You want to go talk somewhere? Yeah, let's go talk. They were still getting me my stuff. Okay.
So what can I do for you? Um, yesterday I was arrested. Uh -huh. um, and I'd like to file an internal affairs complaint. Okay. Um, also like to speak to Sheriff Furlong if that's available. Uh, his and discretion? Absolutely. Up, I, I re I'm just requesting it. I re it's, okay. He's the elected guy in town. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, yeah, I was, I don't know if you've seen the video yet. What video? Uh, the video that I posted of my arrest. I have actually. You have? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So, okay. Um, so what we'll do for our process, we'll have you fill out a written statement. Did she okay. provide you that form yet? Um, I didn't do that. Is there a way that I can uh, go home and type it? And, yeah, do it at like my to. leisure and I just want to make sure I've got a face that I'm talking to and dealing with and uh, mm -hmm. follow, following up. Uh, you can type it or present your complaint in any fashion or media manner that works for you and then I'll take your complaint and I'll process it. I, I think the video clearly shows um, the multiple vi violations of my constitutional rights under the color of law. Like I said, you can state your complaint in whatever yeah. fashion or manner yeah. you wish. I'm, I'm just verbalizing it to you. I, I, I understand, but I'm not here to discuss it no. with you. I'll take the complaint. Yeah, I'll, I'll, okay. I'll, put, I'll definitely put it in writing. And let's see what else was there. Um, the internal affairs, talking to the sheriff, um, and getting my uh, records request uh, handled. So they were helping with that, and she said I need to go somewhere else to get all the body camera footage and all the other footage and everything else that I've requested. Okay. Um, so is she the person to follow up with that and do that with, or? No, your records request will all be done through records. Okay, so. Regardless of what media it is. Okay, so they, they've got access to everything there, yeah, because the gal up front, she was very helpful. Yeah, she's to, great. Yeah, so I want to give her props because, and, and you're being very professional, I appreciate that. Sure. Um, your officers didn't do much investigation last yesterday. Okay. So are, do you understand the process? Do you have any questions about the complaint process? Uh, filing a complaint? Yes. Um, I'm going to write the complaint, give it to you, and then I'll expect some follow-up, and uh, I'll follow up with you. And yeah, you can bring it at any time that we're here. You can make your complaint um, any time during the day. So if it's after hours and I'm gone, another supervisor can take it from you, for example. Yeah, because I, I was I was hotboxed yesterday, too. Okay. At that, uh, yeah. And as you can see, I'm the very mellow. Mm -hmm. I dealt with everybody yesterday very I mellow. Sure. I, I stated exactly what I was doing. And uh, they chose not to go read any case law. And uh, that warden, whatever his name was. Well, like I said, Mr. Rebar, I'm not here to discuss it I'm, with you. I'm, so I'm just pointing out details for you. I'm, formulate, I know, but do that in your complaint, the process. You said you're going to write a statement. Right. We can take it all at once. I won't do an open discussion okay. form. Okay. Yeah. I, I understand your, your perspective. All right. Any of you have any questions before I go then? Nope. And do you have, do you have a card or did she give me I one sure already? There you are. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. So like I said, as soon as you get that done, you're welcome to bring it down. If I'm still here, I'll be happy to take it from you. If not, any supervisor can. Okay. Okay. Thank you much. All right, Mr. Rebar. Have a good one. Thanks. accepted it and she'll respond okay okay she's, she's gonna respond in mm -hmm. perfect okay thank you um should that be within the five business days i'm not certain okay good. thank you good good, good. good answer to, <laughs> i'll leave yourself some room thank you uh -huh. And, and I want to thank you for. I'm sorry, sorry, I oh, I, I wanted to thank you for being very professional and cordial and uh, not minding my camera so much. They're, they're they're everywhere though. Well, I don't know anything about it. So, um, if you want to see what I've done, I can't. Oh, you you can you you can go. I'm, I'm in the middle of oh no, when you go home, don't do this at work. But, but there's a, a video, oh. it's on YouTube, okay. and it was my incident yesterday that led to my arrest. Is there a name of it? Um, it's, if you go look at Auditing Reno 911. Auditing Reno. I'll check it out. 911, and what I do is I, I'm a First Amendment auditor. I'm going around and recording our government in action and oh, the okay. people that work for our government and basically documenting um, how the people interact with the citizens oh, 
and uh, going onto publicly accessible properties and taking pictures and posting them for the public to see. Okay. That was pretty simple. Have a good day, sir. You too.